ChatGPT is a user-friendly natural language processing model created by OpenAI. It can understand and generate human-like text, making it an ideal tool for a variety of tasks. With ChatGPT, you can easily create chatbots, automate sales, and summarize text without the need for human input. Getting started with ChatGPT is easy. Just sign up and start chatting. Although, unfortunately, there is no official API for us to build on currently. But instead of relying on an official API, we can actually utilize the GPT-3 model along with some custom weight attributes to build all sorts of AI tools similar to ChatGPT. With this approach, we have the flexibility to tailor the model to our specific needs, making it even more user-friendly and efficient. Let me show you how it works in Python. First, you'll need to pip install the OpenAI module by typing this command into the terminal. This will allow you to access the GPT-3 model and all of its capabilities. For this next part, you'll need an OpenAI API key, which can be found at the link in the description below. But once you have that module installed and you have a key, we can go ahead and import the module and declare our API key object. To make our program even more user-friendly, let's create a function called ask, which takes in a prompt as an input and returns the generated AI response in the form of text. First, we'll use the OpenAI completion create method to generate the response. Then we just need to specify our model parameters. For this example, we'll set the engine as text DaVinci 003 for the GPT-3 model. Then we'll just use the prompt passed from the input argument along with a few other parameters, such as the max tokens and temperature, which can both be adjusted to customize your overall result. And then finally, we just need to return the generated text from the JSON response. And that's it. We can go ahead and print the response to any question we want. Let's try to ask it what are the top 10 businesses to start. And there we have it. Now before you go running to the comments, I already hear what you're asking. That's cool, but can it do other stuff? The answer is yes. First, we'll go ahead and import whatever our local file name is. For me, it's main. And then here, I'm going to do it as OAI. Then we'll create a prompt instruct string to tell the AI what we want it to do. In this case, we'll have it summarize long text segments for us by using this string. Then we'll ask the user for text to summarize and print the response from GPT-3. For example, let's copy this passage from the Neutron Star Wiki. Then we can go ahead and paste in the text to our terminal, and then we get a perfect summarization of the text provided. In conclusion, GPT-3 is a powerful and versatile tool that can be used for a wide range of natural language processing tasks. The possibilities are honestly endless when you get creative with it. But remember, this demonstration was just the bare minimum of what is possible with GPT-3. But just using these core concepts of prompt engineering and API calls, you can easily create GPT-3 integrated apps in no time. I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a like and a comment if you did. Have a good one. Goodbye.